Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Indian School of Physics guys, this is Nathan here and today I have come with a sample problem for J Advanced 2021. Guys, it is just a speculation that uh, a problem like this or maybe a problem involving such concepts may come. So it's just a guesswork. So it is a flying ring in the magnetic field. Here is the problem statement. A thin uniformly charged ring of mass M and radius R Total charge on the ring is plus Q0. There exists a uniform magnetic field of B0 minus K cap at T equal to 0. The ring is released on the wedge. Uh, the ring rolls without uh, slipping while in contact with the inclined wedge of inclination theta and it is a fixed wedge. Find the time after which a ring will leave the contact with the wedge. So as you can see here, there is a ring and there is no slipping here. Magnetic field is given. So after traveling some distance, it is just uh, leaving the contact with this or you can see it is flying off. Right. So we have to find the time after which it will fly. So here you can see the concept part. We can analyze uh, the translation and rotation of the ring. So here you can see as time will pass due to mg, the VCM will increase and due to this friction, you will uh, have this ring will have some omega also. All right. Now we have to analyze what all forces will be acting on this uh, ring. So you can uh, check. Let's uh, try to calculate magnetic force on the ring. Now, due to its uh, omega, you can see since field is inside and omega is, uh, let's say, clockwise. In this situation, on each element, this force of uh, uh, magnetic field will be acting in radial direction. You can say uh, here either you can use ideal cross B result or uh, Q into V cross B. Due to omega part, this force will be in radial direction and overall this force will get cancelled. All right, and uh, due to the uh, VCM part, now each part is moving with the VCM. So here you can say at any given instant, this magnetic force will be in this direction and its value will be Q into VCM into B. There is mg here and there is normal reaction and this is the friction here. <coughs> All right, so the translational uh, motion I can write as uh, mg sin theta minus FR is equal to M into ACM. Alright, similarly I can write torque about this point and you can see FR into R is equal to ICM into alpha. So MR square ACM by R and if I simplify this uh, FR I am going to get as M into ACM. So from here ACM value I am going to get as G sin theta by 2 which is a constant. So if I know this uh, ACM which is G sin theta by 2 I can write the VCM. It is nothing but uh, g sin theta by 2 into t. Now we can write the forces along uh, this line till the time it is balancing this q vcm b plus n uh, is equal to mg cos theta. So this equation I am writing and now the instant at which normal reaction will be leaving the contact because uh, as vcm will increase normal will start decreasing and if normal is decreasing we can say for leaving contact n is 0. And this condition will come if I substitute the value of uh, VCM which I have calculated earlier which is G sin theta by 2 and if I simplify I am going to get this time t as 2m by qb tan theta. This is going to be the final answer guys. Guys there is uh, <coughs> a small announcement also that uh, price hike uh, is starting very soon and uh, it is ending very soon in fact. Uh, the price will uh, start increasing from 1st of October. So these are the current prices and uh, these are the new prices. So those who are looking for an academy subscription, they can uh, definitely go for uh, this and it will be worth uh, in my opinion. Uh, you can uh, check with the, the old students of an academy how different it is from the regular coaching. <coughs> And guys, this is another one, Amaya single, all in rank 1 in J mains with 100 percentile. And uh, yeah, this, this is the information about the upcoming batches uh, for droppers uh, for J mains and J advance. It is starting, already started from uh, 29th of September. So a lot of students keep asking me for uh, <coughs> droppers batch. So this is the batch they can look for and uh, another batch is uh, also for droppers. It is also starting from 29th of September. So this is uh, this is it guys. 
I hope you have enjoyed this problem and it would have given some more clarity to you in handling such type of problems. It is a moderate level problem and definitely such kind of uh, uh, problems or difficulty level you can expect in advance exam or it can be little higher side also. Thank you. Thanks for watching it.